Hello, Jamal here and welcome back to Let's Play The Witcher 3 where we will continue with The Witcher contracts in Novigrad. So uh, let's get back to the city and uh, go see about this door's slamming shut. So it is right there in the hierarch square. Uh, there's, I think, four or so contracts I have left here in Novigrad. And then there's the big Gwent tournament. Uh, there's also the racing. Uh, at least those I've, I've not seen a torch parties like that going around the city. Well, it is late at night, so maybe that's it. I was just thinking that's how they actually planning to burn some... There must be order. Burn some mages or something, I don't know. There's also more, uh, more drunk folk in the streets. And again, some, uh, horsons, men, I don't care. Okay. I am to meet this, uh, this good, disarred person here in, uh, here in uh, Kingfisher Inn. So let's talk to the man. See about this contract. Actually, since it's been such a long time since I picked this up, let's uh, let's take a look what is it, what it is about. Sprawling out of town manners always hide their fair share of mysteries, and the residents of Novigrad's outskirts were no exception. Where when Geralt found out about a haunted manor owned owned by a certain Kurt Desart, he agreed once more. Once. He agreed at once to look into the matter. Okay, so we have a haunted manor. Uh, maybe we uh, we would actually ask the innkeep who Kurt is, but uh, he is... Upstairs. I only now, only now noticed, uh, noticed the arrow there. Puke or not to puke, that Don't is the touch me. Novigrad, capital of the world. No, it's in that floor. Probably in his room, right? No, it's this man sitting right here. Yes, I talked to him before. He wasn't uh, very uh, friendly. Yes? Count Kurt Dysart. Are you here regarding the contract? Hmm. Wanted to hire a witcher, didn't you? I did, but not just any vagabond. One hears all manner of stories about the lunatics of the School of the Cat. Which do you belong to? <laughs> well, I am. Uh, I am wearing the armor of the armor of the cat, but uh, I'll just be honest about it. School of the Wolf. Ah, yes, a good one. I knew a witcher of this school. Barnabas? Uh, no. Uh, his name did begin with a B. Never mind. Uh, to the matter at hand. Not long past, I acquired an estate east of Novigrad. I got it on the cheap, you see. The seller was very keen to be rid of it. Now, I've learned, the building is set to be haunted. Goes to explain the seller's urgency. I do not believe in ghosts. It is that simple. But my men say the house shakes at night. Walls crumble. Why, even the floors move about. Is there anything to be done? A remedy for this? Mm. Let's talk about my reward first. I beg your pardon? Asking for coin already? But you've not done the job. Need to make sure it's worth my time. Just look at that. Arrives in Navigrat and he's off his head in minutes. Very well. How much do you believe this should cost me? I've been here for, what, uh, a minute? Okay, so uh, I've been very conservative with my hackling, so uh, this time let's go health, uh, over health way and see uh, see what we can get. Like that. Ha ha! That was rich! I could hire three witches for that amount. Now that you've had your jest, how much? All right. <laughs> Uh, let's go to 300. Hmm. No, I'm afraid that's too much. But we're near a price I would consider reasonable. Yeah, his uh, annoyance level didn't go uh, 
uh, up too much. I had no idea how could I ever get to the top level. Do I need some? Uh, do I need some skills for that or something? Yes, agreed. Fine, I'm willing to investigate. How do I get there? An orchard adjoins the property. The house itself you should recognize easily. Cracks cover its walls. Is the key. And good luck. Alright, so where in the city would we go to? It mentioned outskirts, okay. Right. There's also two, uh, two villages I haven't even been to. I have been to this, uh, this dancing windmill. Hmm. I really should, uh, really should get that mod that allows fast travel from anywhere. But since I haven't used it from the start, I will, uh, and I said I would go unmodded, I will go unmodded. They really shouldn't have the option on the map if it's not possible. <laughs> that's uh, that's user interface design right there. Okay, so we have uh, actually a couple of. Uh, mm, you know what? Why don't we? Uh, why don't we go through these question marks here? Here, check the notice board. Uh, check this isolated hut even. Uh, and then, uh, then go see about that. So uh, let's go here. I don't think I've actually been in this uh, this village here either. But uh, let's see. Do they have, for example, any merchants here? It's a small village. Everyone asleep. They have some keys. That's the mul That's the multiple of goose, right? Keys, isn't it? Not, uh, not that common of a word, so I uh, rarely use it, or oh, have to use it. Anyway... So let's go see about... What we have right here? Actually, we don't need roach for that, so we will just uh, go over. Monster nest... Guarded treasure. It seems to be a uh, relatively low level water hack. We will get uh, thrown shit at. But we are prepared for that. So, what were you guarding? Arbitrator, Petrus Filter. Right. What else do you have? Some uh, random, random stuff. And then we had another one. Seems to be on a small island. Island right there. So uh, let's get Roach and go there. Apparently, I can't get on Roach in this <laughs> where Roach was standing, but then uh, Carol decided, okay, okay. Things, uh, things to do outside of this, uh, apart from the from the quests, um, I should should visit some alchemists and uh, get all the. Get all the rewards. I still need a couple of levels before uh, before I go for uh, go for the armor upgrade. And uh, I think I will wait for the master armorer's quest until that. Ah, it's right there. Guarded by. Is it another water hack? No, it's bilge hack. But still a uh, relatively low level. <laughs> oh, I still got the dunk to the face. Oh, 
you can do that in water. Ah, too slow that time. That's the back, should that's the side. Ooh, nice. Surprised me there. Oh. No, 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 no. Ah. Okay, come on, give me that give me that Gwen sign. Oh, that was nice teleport. What's with the flying hacks? Okay, that was uh, for uh, for level fifteen foe. That was way too way too hard. Okay, that was uh, that was a cliff there, but uh, should have probably checked uh, checked a bit more what uh, what he had there. Okay, I uh, I should have used some uh, some oil or something for that. Mm, food. So let's get some of that to regenerate some health. And then we had uh, the notice board. Faster. Let's board there. That's a Wyvern. What level of Wyvern that is? Run, Roach. Should we fight it? Slow now, whoa. I think I had some vibrant oil. What's per se called? It's like a uh, straconic oil, right, of course. And I don't have that, do I? I need more oils. I, I need to visit those alchemists. Yeah, I didn't see it there. Hmm, that sucks. Uh, you know what? Just, uh, just forget about it for now. And it actually sounded it, it started attacking me the moment I uh, turned my back on it. Nice, nice field of flowers. So what do we have here? A place of a place called Yantra. They have a guard dog. Don't drink from the well. There will be toads swimming in the well. Don't drink from it unless you have nothing against what the toads shed in. Bellatane's preparations. Attention, attention, good folk. Bellatane's fast approaching. Unless guards forbid, the war reaches us before that time. Same as every year, we will hold festivities in the commons near village. There will be a grand bonfire and dancing till dawn. Yet man don't live on dance and song alone, so we'll have to prepare the following. Three barrels of apple cider, two barrels of pure grain spirit, three lamps fit for roasting and fatted fatted sow, sausages, blood pudding and liverwurst, measure per head, three bushels of porridge grains, grass sacks, two sacks of potatoes, one of turnips. Around the month's end I'll walk the village and ask who can give what, and if anyone's got a crown or two, to throw in Neddy the elder man. 
A daughter has been born to me. Fellow folk, I am proud to die of a little girl. She is lovely as a nymph, strong as a fiend, and bellows like a furious harpy, except maybe a bit louder. Come to my cottage and drink to her health and health of her darling mother, and perhaps lend a hand choosing a name, for I am having a tough time choosing between Nesla after my brother's wife, or Lesla after no one, but the whole sound I am partial to. They are both pretty and proper, but I cannot give her two names, for we just simple peasants, not high and mighty lords who can drape themselves with names so long no man's capable of remembering, Sorbimir. Nesla or Lesla? Uh, well, I think Sorbimir both will be fine, so you uh, just uh, just do that. Okay. Contract to Apirian Phantom, calling all bounty hunters, trackers and witchers. Misfortune has fell on Honeyfill and Apiary, which for five generations has provided a livelihood for the entire Meyersdorf family. The Apiarian Phantom has descended upon us and has begun to destroy our hives, slay our bees and wreak general havoc all around. I shall be grateful for any help you can provide and guarantee a reward awaits a current can and guarantee a reward awaits you for work well done. Hall of Erens, Mayes, Dorf and Sons. Alright, so we have a contract, so we will take that. Bomers, wow, there are some long notes here. To folk far and wide, I've told you plenty of times you've never put in writing as I'm doing now, so that no, none may hide behind the defense of ignorance. My boy Bomer sworn to the great mother Melitele that he'll never touch beer nor spirit again as long as he lives. And it's a good thing he has, for when he lost our coat, hence Father Jern and very breeches he was wearing in a game of cards two weeks back. I was mighty tempted to toss him out of his bare arse, but at least give it thorough hiding. So if anyone spies Pomir walking towards the a tavern, come see me at once, or you'll get Novigrad and you'll get Novigrad crown for your trouble. Likewise, if I see any man encouraging him to drink, offering him a pint or a snifter or of anything, then that scoundrel will learn that's a whole fit for more than just blowing Lily Mira. The enemy never sleeps. Fellow northerners, the enemy never sleeps. Black devils have pitched camp on camp other side of the river. Our lads will defend us, their last bolt and last drop of blood, but you, too, need to be prepared to serve your fatherland. Steel and blood aren't the only thing a man can wield in the fight for Redania. A very eye and a cocked ear do battle just as well, so if you see a stranger hanging about your village, or someone hiding in the bush, or you can hear someone talking with a foreign accent, send an envoy to the nearest outpost at once, because you might just spot a Nilfgaardian spy. Do this and you not only serve Redania, but you enrich yourself as well, for we will reward all such help, as generously as it deserves, together shoulder to shoulder, onwards to victory. Captain Fit Freeman. So we have a uh, Apirian Phantom. Uh, actually, let's see uh, how close that is. Are we, uh, are we right there? It's a close level as well. Let me see. Wait, isn't that a? Uh, isn't that like right there? Wait. Ah, no. Okay. Ah, uh, you know what? We are close by, and that's a low-level quest. I should have uh, should have been here earlier. Let's uh. Let's take that one instead first. Come on. Uh, such a small village that not even uh, not even merchant. So let's go to a uh, Mirrorsdorf mansion and see about this uh, phantom. Probably some sort of wraith. We've uh, dealt with uh, several of those. It's traveling merchant here. Not so fast, Roach. A small little, uh, small little camp there. Mm. 
Oh, I thought the road would take me there, but uh, okay, I took a little shortcut there. Nice, uh, nice manner. Okay, just, just for this reason, it's nice to uh, get this contract because I, uh, I wouldn't necessarily come to a place like this, otherwise. Hey there. It's nice to, uh, nice to see these kind of uh, high-born buildings as well. Uh, also uh, shows how uh, they've put a uh, lot of thought into the world, as we've seen already. But uh, things like this uh, matter as well. Just not. Not just, uh, not just generic buildings. Welcome to Honeyfield, traveler. Hmm. Well, I guess the name should have been a giveaway that they, uh, they might have been halflings. Holofernes Meyersdorf at your service. Meet my sons, Bernie, Franklin, and Hugo. Hmm. Any relation to Rico Meyersdorf? Uh, uh, yes. My youngest son. Sadly, he fled the family business. Went to seek fortune in the big city. Why do you ask? Do you know him? <laughs> well, yeah, we've met. But that's not why I'm here. Came about the notice you posted. It's the Apiarian Phantom. It's ravaging my hives. As far as my reward's concerned. Let's ask for a bonus rate of 35. Hmm. Honeyfill's not been generating the revenues of old since the Phantom appeared. Would you be willing to reduce your price? Just to just to see the dialogue, this is worth it. Okay, so uh, maybe it's a level thing. I didn't he didn't get nearly as annoyed as, uh, as the other guy did. So let's light drive thirty. Hmm. Honeyfill's not been generating the revenue. Okay, so twenty three. Ah, oh, as you wish. Fail to rid us of the phantom and we'll go belly up anyway. I shall look upon your fee as an investment. So it's a deal? It is. It is. You do realize this apiarian phantom. Well, there is no such thing. It's a monster, gotta be. A wraith, maybe. Any of your workers see anything? I did. I was cleaning a hive when I heard a farmhand cry out. Screamed as though he'd been stung by a whole swarm all at once. I ran to him, but he was dead. Any stings on him? None. D he looked like he had frostbite. Blue lips, frost in his hair, and dead bees lay all around him. Hmm. Farmhand who died. What did you do with the body? Wouldn't mind a look. Too late for that. We buried the poor fellow a few days back. Where the phantom appear? Can any of you show me? I'll go. Come with me. Okay. This way. Follow me. Where do you get the idea it was an apiarian phantom? It's a beekeeping superstition. You mismanage the bees' offerings, the phantom appears. He destroys the hives and kills the bees, so that no one can use these noble creatures for ignoble purpose. Sick to your bees on the competition, eh? No. Father recently signed a contract with the Redanians. So the Phantom's from Nilfgaard. <laughs> Look at this one. Hmm. Phantom doesn't like Nilfgaardians. Hmm. That's an interesting thought. So they are beekeepers. And they actually have some uh, beehives. This is the place. Here's where the phantom killed the farmhand. Maybe it left some tracks. Ooh. Hmm. Covered in frost. Cold must have killed the bees. The Apiarian phantom's got large feet. And it's pretty damn heavy. Hmm. I don't think... I, I don't think it's a wraith. And... Frozen? Tracks disappear in the water. 
Doubt anything's hiding in this puddle they call a lake. Need to check the other side, see if the trail goes on. So would it be there or here? Uh, what 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 would freeze things like that? A bit of random loot there. So would we continue on this side? Let's try here. Mm. Not here. So yeah, what would freeze things like that? I was thinking of an ice troll, but uh, it's more like a more like a phantom. Yeah, there's some drowners here. Show me a pond, and I'll show you the drowners. But they didn't destroy the hives. A bit sloppy again. So the game obviously wanted me to come here, so Geralt could say his uh, comments about drowners. Uh, I think I better heal. I did buy them that other... Uh, other healing potion kind as well. Now that I think about it. Uh, what was it called? I think it was this one. Oh really, I'm mi even missing Elko Hest. Why do oh, I need, oh. Wait, it's a, it's a decoction, but it's not. Why to reverse to decoction? I don't think I actually have that. All right. Hmm. Can you use some alcohol? Hope I didn't sell any alcohol. That was uh, careless if I if I did. Okay, so I can't create that. But uh, that's uh, that's one thing. To know some of the decoctions are actually ingredient to uh, to a potion. Yeah, through here, gotta find another way in. So what do we have here? Some uh, random boots. I'm not going to fool. going through all of these. Usually the barrels don't have anything too special. You need to have a chest. Just to have something uh, like diagrams or such. Or the random rewards. Uh, well, this certainly seems to be a way in. It's locked. I got the key right here. The father began building this house for Bernie, but ran out to coin. It's been standing half finished since. Wonderful hiding place for whatever destroyed your hives. I'm going in. You go home and bar your door. Who knows what might come out of there. It's a hound of the wild hunt. How the hell did it end up here? Oh no, it actually got out. Well, that, yeah, that Rachel explains the... You down. That explains the... Explains the frost. What are you doing here, man? Should I actually take the horse? Oh, 
Oh, please tell me I can... It will probably stop for a fight at some point, but I uh, probably could have caught it with, uh, with Roach. Stop running in circles, stupid dog. Silver. Okay, so this was the place where uh, he decided uh, it was uh, time to fight. Mm, Igna is probably good against them. Okay, that was yours. That was your special. Alright. Uh, Roach was... Uh, Roach was following me there uh, all along. So I could have jumped on him if the, if the chase continued, but... Uh, obviously this was the place where the... Fight was supposed to take place. Uh, quite catch you, what you said. What happened, ma'am? As if the war weren't enough, sir. I'm losing me ends. How am I to live, eh? Get a look at the thieves. What thieves? It's monsters taking me chickens. An ordinary thief I'd nab on me own, but beasts? What am I to do? Hmm. I can help you. Not for free. But you're advanced in years. So I won't ask too much. Poppycock. Not much, he says. But you'll take me liver come the end. Well, no one else is lining up to help me. <laughs> me end started disappearing about a week past. Always take one at a time, the vermin. One at a time? Interesting. Monsters leave any tracks? Aye. Prince of wolf paws, but strange life. As if the wolves walked on their hind legs. And don't you be like that wise ass Yossip from Down Warren tells me I'm mistaken. But few know beast tracks like I do. Me man with the best poacher for miles around. I see. I'd still like to examine the prince myself. I think, uh. I think someone is uh, pretending to be a wolf and stealing the poor lady's chickens. Wolf prints, all right. Though no, something's not right. Yeah, something's not right for sure. Okay, let's see who's stealing stealing the chickens. Maybe, uh, maybe this was the reason why the why the hound actually ran here. So it was a kind of a clever way in uh, wolf prints and small footprints next to them. No signs of struggle. So kind of a way to uh, way to get you into this quest uh, without feeling you were you were uh... little footprints. Interesting. Okay, so someone took the wolf. Uh... Someone took the wolf paws off their legs. I hope it's not uh, halflings. They run out of bees, stay away, hello, children. Watch out, PJ! He's got a sword! A soldier! He won't take us alive! 
Not gonna hurt you. Then why are you here? That captain with the black moustache send you? Don't know any captain. Followed the tracks of the hen-stealing monsters here. <laughs> You're a lot of fuss over a few skinny hens. The old lady didn't like them much anyway. She were always yelling at them. And she looks like a witch. Hmm. Has this been around? Are these the same kids I helped before? Randomly running into them, I think I gave them some crowns. Why are you in the woods? Where are your parents? Soldiers caught him. We was crossing the river, but they spotted us. We ran, but Mum and Dad had bags. Told us to flee. Lived in the woods alone ever since? Sure. Find a lot of things. Steal a few others. We get by just fine. Where'd the wolf prints come from? Da once hunted down a wolf. Gave each of us a paw for good luck. We tied him to our shoes. Cause wolves steal hens, right? Sure. Usually not one at a time, though. You survive by stealing from others. This can't end well. You should ask someone for help. Who'd help us? Who'd take us? Once we've got all the hens, we'll go deep in the woods. Petey says we's gonna hunt where animal hides, so a tent out of leaves. I'd never grow up. <laughs> hmm. Last bit's most likely. Good luck, I guess. And watch out for yourselves. Hmm. Like yeah, that, uh, that, that was uh, kind of my idea that uh, what would probably happen. Maybe, uh, maybe the old lady is actually, uh, Looks a little bit lonely, and um, if you just ask, she actually wouldn't mind uh, taking the children in. But uh, I'm not sure if we, if we tell them that the kid stole, stole the hens, uh, she might be uh, too, too uh, upset. Hey, witcher! What is it? Found a group of kids in the woods. They were the ones stealing your hens. Oh, children, eh? Riding on the backs of wolves, were they? Never any wolves here. The kids are just clever. If they've anything in their noggins, they'll stay away from me and house now. Mm. Take them in. Give them a home. Won't steal from you then. Sure, but I'll be feeding the whelps. I'll gain nothing from it. But... Suppose I'll give it some thought. Oh! Alright, so that was the end of that, and now uh, it would be nice if the game actually uh, had some logic in the, some logic in this, and it would uh, even go back to the quest you were on before, or something close on, by, Rich. instead of just the main quest. But so well, I remember where I was going, and I remember what quest I was on, so it's all good. How did you fare? Did you drive off the phantom? Yes. Stop. Plumbing. Your Hyperion phantom was a hound of the wild hunt. Eternal fire! Hounds run with the wild hunt as well. About two weeks back, I woke suddenly in the night, saw the hunt streaking across the sky. Hound must have gotten separated then. Couldn't go back, so it hid in the empty house. It's hardly compensation for your losses, but at least the hound won't destroy any more hives. Thank you, Witcher. It's true. Nothing like hiring a specialist. <laughs> Enough for today, boys. Let's go home. We have a big day tomorrow. Not Let's many experience hides, points because I was uh, I was quite over leveled for this. But uh, let's now go to the one I was going for before. So, uh, the haunted mansion. I think it is. Uh, we were pretty close to it when we were fighting the... Fighting the Hound. Try not to hit any trees here. Okay, so is this the place? Yes. Roach, why don't you stay here? Okay. This traveling merchant is obviously following me, so let's uh, let's see what he has. Greetings. 
Tin guy. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. Well, maybe I've seen him. I don't know. So what are you selling? Some uh, greater rune stones, actually. So not, uh, not that bad. Uh, I might need some of these. So let's take. Uh, let's take five. Uh, mistletoe. I needed that for something. I haven't found any, so let's buy that. And uh, these ones as well, the honeysuckles. I needed these for something as well. Uh, let's buy eight just in case. Uh, what else I haven't seen? Not sure if I've seen too many all, too many all spice. So let's get those. Gnatia petals, same thing. Uh, the other things I think I... Not sure about this this one, so let's get a couple of those ones as well. Uh, not sure about these either, so let's get five. Thanks. Farewell. So let's see about, uh, see about the alchemy. I, I will rest here as well. Just in case uh, what I will face something something stronger. Just turning those into something better. Alright, I have one red mutagen here actually. Not any uh, no greater one yet, I think. Yeah, no. Um I will check the character screen actually as well when I get there. Uh enhanced dragon stream. So what does this use? Demos for dust. Yeah, this was the mistletoe. Also some other things I only have one of. Brionia phosphorus. Alright, but uh, uh Northern Wind. Yeah, let's uh let's make the Dragon Stream enhanced version. Uh Northern Wind have plenty of those, so let's make that. Decoctions. Increase mm. sign intensity, grave hack. I think this katakan, katakan decoction is the one I might actually use. Increases critical hit chance. Uh, I think it's probably unique to the, the Katakan vampire or something. Um, let's let's create that. I don't know if I will use it, but uh, I will take it anyway. Yeah, that's a, that's a powerful one as well. And if you can run run. All the time. Each blow landed increases attack power until either fight ends or damage other than from potion toxicity is taken. Kinda like that one as well. Let's create that. And you know what? Let's create that one as well. Well, just because. And enhanced specter oil. And also using the mistletoe. Let's, uh, let's create that, so when we fight some, uh, fight something, we will use that. The insectoid oil, let's make that. Let's make the enhanced insectoid oil. So we always have the best version. Then we can go to a... Uh, I, uh, I think the game almost should remove these ones. So I at least have an option to uh, filter out. <laughs> Just when I said it. Uh, yeah, I don't need those that I have created already. The Black Blood, Witcher's Blood in Tunes Vampires. Uh, uh, sure. Enhanced Black Blood, sure. Who knows, maybe I will use that. Enhanced White Honey. Alright, that's the last, last uh, Algo Hest we had. Uh, short lore, I don't need that. Alright. Is there any 
anything in particular I want to craft? Brionia. Probably want this one to uh, immediately restore a large portion of vitality and a kind of an emergency healing on that one. So let's pin that and I, uh, I will see those items in there. See those items when I go shopping. Uh, I don't think I can pin several ones, can I? So I really need this cherry cordial for the alcohest as well. So can I, uh, if I pin that one, that other pin go away? Yeah, that's uh, that's a bit stupid. Well, I see alcohest at least with that. So that's uh, that's fine. 